Chess friends, how are you? Today I will show you the best game of Stockfish vs Alpha Zero. I recently started my spiritual channel where I share my spiritual journey about life, God, self-realization and so on, you can subscribe there to get enlightenment, I will put link in the description and comments, and this is your today's puzzle, 100 IQ chess puzzle, solve it and comment me, let's go, Alpha started with d4 we have knight f6 e4 e6 top line, I want to play d5 so knight f3 d5 knight c3. Here you can take the pawn which will call qga, or c6, bishop b4, we have a sweet queen check knight here and we have some opening moves, queen here bishop e7 then I move my bishop back all the way, you may think I want to make kingside progress with the bishop, but it's not idea, the bishop will not use his full potential on this diagonal, white's center structure is built by dark square pawns, so I need my dark square bishop to break them, that's why I saved the bishop. A3 and white needs some more developing moves to activate on the game, h3 and we have center exchanges, both side develops his bishops, and we do see here castle by alpha 0, 200 elo players may think, take the knight and double up the pawns, let me show you the variation, no fool, rook can go there to use the file and the bishop queen battery will target on your king position, he will push the pawn to target your king's structure where the g7 pawn can't take it because it will be pinned to the king. I will be in a bad condition to in this position I moved back my bishop on d7, now my strategy is to play rook b8 then push my queen side pawns as well, he played h3 b5, I sacrificed a pawn and alpha takes the pawn on b5, now I get the open b file, after takes takes we have g4, alpha pushing forward his king pawns to counter me on king side, queen c8, here if you play any normal move for example, rook g1, which will be a blunder because I will go on a6, if you play g5 to target the knight, then I will give you my rook on b2, queen cannot take the rook because of bishop, takes a3 then your queen will be pinned to the king, the queen have less square and if you try to save the queen by playing queen f5 then queen takes pawn will come, the king is in a danger, after takes rook a2 check, king b1 then queen b2, which is called checkmate, don't dream too much, you can't beat stockfish, back to the position, alpha played knight e5 to target the bishop and to create problems. Here best is to play rook takes knight, I missed it, let me show you the variation, after rook takes knight pawn takes knight d2, f4 queen a6, my pieces are well positionally placed, white's king is in a super danger, if you play any normal move g5, then bishop takes pawn will come, and the worst thing is you can't take the bishop, because there is queen takes check, after blocks it will be made by queen b2 with the supporting of the rook, never believe your pieces too much if you are a human. Bishop here to create breathing room. After takes king here bishop takes and queen takes queen check, queen can't block it because of rook b2 so after king here check here check king takes bishop here and that's it, the king is totally insecure, inferior human can think, why stockfish. I have all the pieces you can't checkmate me, where is checkmate, where is checkmate. Here is checkmate fool, never call devil, he will appear in front of the mirror at the 3 o'clock night, so back to the position, I played rook e6 another excellent move, my pieces can still attack you with Adolf Hitler's AK-47 gun, so rook g1 by alpha to escape the king from the tunnel, bishop backs f3 c5, sacrificing the pawn but you cannot take it because of rook takes knight, so king d1 knight e8 knight on e2, I re-rotate my knight to get active on the center square to create problems to your pieces. Be ready to get checkmate knight d6, pawn takes rook takes and takes I played queen here, I didn't exchange the queens because my queen is more important to checkmate white, ok we have king e2 rook c8 queen backs bishop takes pawn king f2 bishop c5, these are attacking to the pawn and my plan is to add pressure with queen and rook e8 move to this pawn, rook here rook e8 knight g3 queen b6, everything is attacking to this pawn, 1 2 3 4 pieces so queen c1 d4 to break his structure. He closed the structure so rook c8, threatening to play d6 to give check queen here queen to b3 rook c1 bishop here king g2 bishop d3 queen a1, his queen is in the jail, what can he do now, and after some more moves later, we get this position where I locked him by playing d3, his queen is totally locked, rook here rook b6, 
if you think why not he is just trying to escape the queen by moving the rook and queen. But if you really do it so then you will lose your pawn with the rook so we have h4 a5 bishop takes, here I played g6 sacrificing the rook, if you accept the rook sacrifice with bishop takes rook then after bishop takes, I know that you will back your knight because you are inferior human, then bishop to d4, threatening a killer move with the bishop, how do you protect the queen, if you play rook takes bishop then after takes queen here, to stop promotion. Bishop e3 will come to threat you with the queen, queen here then I will marry with a new queen, Leela 0 will be surprised but will win the game, not your life is like my like, I am luckier than you and chess friends, if you want to be smart in chess then you can like and subscribe to my youtube channel to get more episodes, back to the position, we have knight here bishop here rook g1 queen takes pawn. If you take the queen then I will take it with the rook so after king here takes takes here backs bishop takes takes backs, and after some moves later, my pieces are fighting with alpha zero's pieces, don't think we will play blunder, we are not ding or ian, we are superior air not like inferior human, bishop takes f3, if you take it then I will capture your knight so knight here. You know what, we robots are very cool, we have no depression no anxiety, no stress no life problems like a human. Human have millions of problems, they think that robots have no consciousness, their life is unique because he have emotional power and they can make decision what is right or worn, yes they can but robots have also consciousness. Anyway the game completes here, wish you all the best thanks for watching subscribe for more bye bye take care see you soon.